Hey awesome universe, hey awesome nice people, awesome how you all doing, I hope you've all had a great overview on the world. And this is the Premier League roundup for week 30 of the Premier League season. And well, as we get closer to the last 10 games, and we pretty much are on the last 10 games, here we go, here are the results for some big, big games, and here we go. Basically, Hull City faced up against Ma Manchester City. And Man City won a big game they needed to win to stay in touch with Chelsea. 2-0 away, so big result for them, a good goal by David Silva and Edin Dzeko pretty much sealing the deal. So Manchester City still in the hunt for the, for the uh, Premier League title and after Chelsea in a run, and we'll get more on that title race later. Alright, Stoke City faced off against West Ham, and Stoke won 3-1, so Stoke pretty much, yeah, they're pretty much definitely safe by the end of the season. West Ham a little bit in danger, but I think they've got probably enough quality to stay up. Everton won 2-1 against Cardiff at home, so that pretty much shows you that even though I'm going to get to the point where I start talking about everything, you know, Everton I think will finish about 6th this season, or 7th, so, but to be honest, for Roberto Martinez, a very, very good first season for them. Okay, Sunderland and Crystal Palace, two relegation sides, draw 0-0, bad result for both two, because you would think they would want to get the points against each other. Southampton... Faced up against Norwich City, they won 4-2 at home. You know, Southampton, they've been a bit of gloom in the last, you know, not in a good way, in a, in the last few months with their seasons, kind of gone to crap, so, you know, a good victory for them. Norwich in the relegation battle still. Okay, Swansea's season, they were at home against West Brom, their season, bad season continues. West Brom, big win for them, 2-1 away. And the last game of Saturday was Aston Villa versus Chelsea. Big game in the tire race, and Villa won 1-0. Holy crap, that it really fixed the tire race, and I'll get to it in a minute. On the Super Sunday, it was Manchester United versus Liverpool, one of the biggest matches in football history and in football today. Manchester United at Old Trafford, Man United lost 3-0 to, to Liverpool. Two Steven Gerrard penalties and a Luis Suarez goal, basically. Sealed the win, and I'll get more to it in a minute. And the North London derby, Tottenham at home at White Hart Lane against Arsenal. Ooh, Arsenal won. And you can tell because I'm a Tottenham fan, that's why I do that. But, you know, Arsenal won. You know, the game was kind of crap, to be honest. <laughs> Just to say it. But, you know, it was a real... I have to admit, I'll give Riziki credit. It was a great... It was a scream of the goal. It was a really good goal, so I'll give him that credit. But here we go. Let's just get to it. With the relegation battle, let's just get to the relegation battle. The relegation battle, I reckon anyone can go down. So, you know, I think it's going to stay like that until the final day. And whoever's stuck down there the lowest is, is totally fucked. All right, top four, that's pretty much over. Because Man United are seventh, Tottenham are fifth, and Everton are sixth. And with, you know, with Arsenal, Liverpool, and Man City, and, and Chelsea so far away from fifth place... Yeah, well, maybe, you never know, those team, Tottenham and, you know, Man United might pack, uh, catch up in Everton, but it, with the tyre race the way it is right now, I don't think so, I think it's going to be one hell of a tyre race right now, so the top four race is pretty much over at the moment, we'll see in the future weeks if it comes back, but here we go, the tyre race, the tyre race is, as Chelsea lost, that opened up the tyre race completely, because also these teams do play each other, so that's really interesting, but... Basically, Arsenal, Manchester City, Liverpool, and, you know, Chelsea, all in the tie race together. The champions, Manchester United, seventh place. You know, hell, they might not even finish in the Europa League at this point. You know, it's pretty crazy. And, yeah, so, I can't, I, you know what, I have no idea who's going to win the league right now. It's crazy. It keeps going from one thing to the next. So, we're going to have to wait and see. And leave a like and comment for your opinion. Subscribe for more videos. And football fans, soccer fans... You know, I do Champions League videos, I do Premier League videos, I do um, FA Cup videos, you know, Capital One Cup videos, aka League Cup, I do World Cup videos, I do um, uh, Euros videos, I do all types of things about football, so football and soccer fans, subscribe to my channel if you want more videos, and the tyre race, holy shit, is crazy right now, and um, 10 games to go, so we're going to see who wins. Alright, bye guys, love you, remember, you're awesome, alright, bye guys.